Hello everyone, this is Ram Prasad Venugopal from Informatica Support. In this video KB, I will walk you all through the Supply360 portal UI. The agenda of today's video is Introduction on Supplier Portal What are the prerequisites? How to sign up or register a new user? Workflow to approve new user? What is Supplier Profile? Preference What is Supplier Portal? The Supplier Portal is a web application. Supplier representatives use the Supplier Portal to initiate a relationship with your organization and to fill out an online application form. After business users in your organization approve a supplier, the Supplier representatives use the Supplier Portal to upload documents, update information and monitor performance. What is Portal Configuration Tool? Portal configuration tool is used to import, customize a pre-configured portal or to create a new custom portal based on the requirement. Portal config tool can be accessed using the below URL. What are the prerequisites? We need to have MDM installed with Supplier 360. Pre-configured portal imported in portal config tool. Portal login provider uploaded to the security providers in Hub Console. Sign up. A login provider authenticates the supplier portal user, that is portal login provider.jar. Pre-configured portal uses supplier registration view on sign up page. By default, Informatica data as service is used for address validation. It is configured in BE view to BE transformation, that is supplier registration view to supplier. Email ID provided by the user is marked as the username. On sign up, the portal user is added to the hub console users tab and the status will be registered. Status can be checked in CBO party status table. Person and organization will be inserted as records in CBO party table. Workflow to approve new user. On sign up, the create supplier portal process is invoked. The workflow reaches draft state and waits on the portal user to log into the supplier portal and complete the registration by providing required details. Registration involves user to fill in general information, product and services, financial details, sub-suppliers, documents. On successful submission of the registration form, status of the portal user changes from registered to submitted. Workflow progress to four-step approval process. Below are the roles of approvers who verifies the details of new supplier through tasks from supplier UI. Commodity manager, finance manager, contract manager, complaints manager. Portal user receives mail during sign up, approval, or rejection of the workflow. After completion of all approvals, status of portal user changes to approved state. Supplier profile Supplier representatives use the supplier portal to view the supplier profile. When a supplier representative signs on to a supplier portal, the representative sees the welcome dashboard. After a supplier is approved, the supplier application is converted to a supplier profile. The supplier profile contains all the information from the application. Supplier representatives can log back into the portal after approval to verify, update and maintain their information in the supplier profile. Reference To configure portal, please refer to the portal configuration guide. To create supplier profiles through portal, please refer user guide. Now let us proceed with the demo. For prerequisites, we have an MDM environment where Supplier 360 is installed. Under security providers, portal login provider has been uploaded. And a pre-configured portal has been imported into the portal config tool. We can get the portal URL by pressing these three dots and uh, clicking copy URL. The URL of supplier portal is copied. Now let's open a new tab and paste this URL. This will allow us to access the pre-configured portal. To sign up a new user, we have to click on the sign up button. We can see the sign up form where we need to pass all the mandatory fields. In the sign up form, I have passed all the required fields. That is first name, last name, email address and password. The email address provided by the user is taken as the username. 
we have address validation configured in this portal for dunce number i am providing a random nine digit number after entering all the mandatory information i am hitting the sign up button i could see a successful registration message on the supplier portal side by this time a new user should have been created at the hub console user tab now let us log into the supplier portal with the new user created i am using the mail id as the username password is whatever we provided at the sign up page on logging in it is taking me to the registration form where i can see the welcome message and an overview of all the pages which i have to fill out in this form in this general information page country of incorporation is a mandatory field so i'm passing the value as united states moving to the next page this address is what we filled during the registration of the new user moving to the next page products and services the product and services has to be added by the business users from the supplier 360 ui for now i am choosing driver and uh, moving to the next page i'm providing a sample value and moving on to the next page here tax information and insurance are mandatory fields so i am entering and we are providing a random tax number for insurance different type is cargo insurance currency can be australia dollar moving on to the next page references you can add any references using this add button similarly you can add sub suppliers using this uh, add button you can attach any documents in the similar way and on clicking this preview button it will give us the preview of all the details which we have entered throughout this registration form we can verify it from here and uh, click on submit or we can utilize the submit button at the top it is asking for confirmation on submission which we can give okay on pressing okay the action is completed successfully in the active was console we could see a new workflow has been triggered on creating this new supplier user which is create supplier portal process is currently waiting on the four step approval process where the business managers has to verify the details provided by the supplier representative and approve them to the task from supplier ui i have logged into the supplier 360 ui through application administrator user now that i have completed the approval process using the application administrator role on activos console i could see the create supplier portal process has been executed successfully and now the status of the portal user should have been changed to approved status so i'm logging back into the portal using the same user where now the supplier user will be able to verify update and maintain the supplier information from this portal site we would love to hear from you you can mail us at supportvideos@informatica.com thank you